Training drills are taking place at schools across the country, including right here in our area after the Florida High School massacre. Yeah, emergency responders and law enforcement officials in Livingston County have staged rescue efforts in the event of a shooting, and now they're training for recovery efforts. And now Detroit's Simon Chowdhury participated in the event. She explains why they wanted members of the media there who are asking some pretty tough questions. Stand up. We're going to go single file. Six clear GSW to the abdomen and a leg injury. Do you need additional fire resources inside? In the process of reunifying students with parents following the critical incident this morning at Brighton High School. This is a drill. A student opens fire at school, killing nine people before turning the gun on herself. Even though this scenario is part of an active shooter training, she didn't black out. it's a reality that schools and law enforcement face. You need to prepare. You need to have plans. First responders are practicing the recovery portion of a school shooting. I've been shot. This is after the threat has been eliminated. The goal is to get students out of the building. Assistance. Make sure that they are physically okay. Are they emotionally okay? and start to get their information. The team did a recovery drill last May and planned for today's event since October. It was a capability that we felt that we could improve upon and build upon. Organizers invited the media to participate as well. They sent out mock press releases and they're holding a mock press conference. As soon as I get that information, I'll get it back to you. We asked questions as if this was a real event. What do we know about the suspect? We know that in a real event, the media will be present. You're going to come. Uh, we're going to have television, radio, press, everybody will be there. After the Parkland shooting, those participating say they have to be ready. And I think it is a bold reminder how real these events are and that they continue to happen. We found Ian. <laughs> How's it going? Hopefully we'll never have to utilize this. In Brighton, Simon Chowdhury for the Now Detroit. Wow, sad that mm. has to be done, but so very important. I right? was thinking that too, right? We as parents know they need to do this type yeah. of training to be prepared. But you remember when we grew up, we just prepared for tornadoes. We'd hide yeah, under the desk. And so that was the extent of it, but it's a new day. Heartbreaking mm -hmm. to have our kids go through this. but.